We're in chapter 24 of the book of Jeremiah. It's only 10 verses. And it starts off, well, I think it starts off in a great way. Listen to what it says. The Lord showed me. And and that's such a great phrase because that's what the Lord does over and over again in our lives. He shows us things. He reveals things to us. And in this situation, he reveals to Jeremiah this image of two baskets of figs set before the temple. And he's trying to figure out, Lord, what's this, these, these figs? And one basket is good figs, and one basket is bad figs. And God reveals to him what the image, what the picture is all about. He, he shows him, and then he reveals to him what it means. The good figs, well, it's those who are being taken captive into Babylon by Nebuchadnezzar. The bad figs, the ones who will be left behind, and they're going to suffer, they're going to be judged because of their hard-heartedness against God. So the whole picture is what you would think would be just the opposite. Those taken into captivity, oh man, they're going to be there a long time. They're under false gods, they're under false rulers, all this bad stuff. But really, it's good. And it's through that that God will preserve them and eventually send them back with a whole heart towards Him. The bad figs that get to stay, well, God's going to deal with them in a very harsh way because of their unrepentant hearts and how bad their life is. They're the bad figs and there's the good figs. Well, here's kind of the application for our devotion today. Sometimes God will put us in situations and circumstances and places in our life where we think, man, this is so bad. But God's trying to show us something. God's trying to teach us something. And what he does is he preserves their life and trains and and builds them up and brings them back with a whole heart. You might be going through things in your life right now and it says, man, this is bad. But God is trying to show you something. God is trying to teach you something. And sometimes what seems like a period of time where everything's not working out is that God is working out something for his good as well as yours. So here in the book of Jeremiah, chapter 24, the the Lord says that he will bring them back with a whole heart. He says, I will give them a heart to know me, that I am the Lord, and they shall be my people, and I will be their God, for they shall return to me with their whole heart. God shows, he teaches, and what's the bottom line? Well, he's after a whole heart that will serve him and know him. What may look bad in your life right now may be exactly what you need that God might challenge you, restore you, renew you, and rebuild you with a whole heart. 